Hey guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Rafaela. It feels weird to be filming because I don't think I've filmed since maybe October, but I'm back and today I'm doing a Kiko haul. But before we go into the video, please make sure to subscribe, uh, like, do all those good things. Maybe I should do it in some type of order. I don't think I'll do so because I'm not prepared. And I just want to show you everything. I'm so excited. I got everything on sale, so I got a really good deal. Um, I'm just going I'm just going to go straight to it. The first thing I got is this powder. This is the, their Lost in Amalfi finishing powder, face fixing powder. It looks like this. Please ignore my nails. I'm going to do them maybe tomorrow if I feel like it. I don't know. It comes like this. Um, I have to say I already used this. So yeah, that's why it looks kind of messy but you know what i was really excited and this powder is just so good this is just so fine so light it feels almost like nothing but it makes my skin look so beautiful this is perfect to set my foundation especially on my oily zone so on my forehead underneath my eyes like the t-zone um because you know right now the like trendy makeup look is the clean look so very glowy very natural but i'm naturally super oily and i just do not like to look at myself in the mirror and just feel like a frying pan or something so then i got my mood radiant blush looks like this this packaging i don't, I, I don't know how to describe this but this just feels like silicone-y? I don't know if it's like silicone or something. I don't know. But it's a really nice soft texture. Okay, so it looks like this. I got this in the shade 2, Coral Sunset. And it looks like this. This is gigantic, so it's going to last me a lifetime super glowy it smells amazing um, it doesn't taste amazing let's just say that and it looks like this just using my very old primer brush can you see it it's just very natural glowy then I got this uh, Mood Boost Perfecting Powder. I just love like this very old Kiko uh, Dusk and Sunshine Perfecting Powder. It's completely broken. Um, I tried to fix it with some alcohol um, and the bits that I had left. Oh, it's just... yeah. So I really needed to get a new one. And this is just, again, the same packaging. Oh, I love this shade. This is such a cute baby pink color. Anyway, the silicone, like super soft packaging. And it comes with this. I don't know if you can tell, but it's super glowy. Again, very fine. Feels like nothing, but on the skin it just looks so beautiful this is the best perfecting powder i've ever tried i mean i'm pretty sure this has the same formula as this one and i already recommend it to my friends and they love it because it's just you know back in maybe 2014 um like old youtube days with zuela and all those british youtubers um Zoe Suggs, as well, I used to use these hourglass powders, I think, and they looked so glowy, so cute, but they don't sell hourglass here in Portugal, or if they do, it's just super expensive, and I don't even know if it's cruelty-free or not, anyway, um, but yeah, so this gives me hourglass old YouTube back-in-the-day vibes, and I'm here for it. Then I got this Skin Trainer CC Blur Perfecting Skin optical corrector for all skin types um, it looks like this I got this in the shade 
3 neutral and this is a primer I really needed a good face primer this has a very interesting texture um, it's just very fluffy and once you blend it on the skin I'm currently using it on my face say goodbye to lines pores anything just then I got this Kiko Lost in a Malfi Jelly Highlighter. Let's open this. Let's just do it. It looks like this. Super glowy. This is how it looks on the skin. Yes, I'm definitely going to be using this as a blush. So glowy. So cute and it dries down completely so yeah completely completely dry I think this is going to work very good with oily skin I got this um, mood boost pearls of light highlighter it looks like this so it comes with this little applicator This is how it looks. I don't think I'll be using this applicator. It smells nice, not too strong. Moving on to the last highlighter. I got this Kiko, obviously, a holiday. Hola! Let's go. Queria a atenção para ter. You missed being in my videos, did you? Say hi! Hello everyone! You need to just stay very quiet and still so I can finish filming, please. Can you, baby? No? Oh, Antonia. Fica assim, sentadinha. Eu tô... Oh, meu Deus! Sim, exatamente. As I was saying, I got this uh, Holiday Fab, Fab, Fable, Fable? I, Fable? I don't know this um, word. Mol Molten Glow Highlighting Drops Face and Body. Okay, so I got this in the wrong shade, but I think this is going to be so cute for summer. Is this Pantera approved? Panterinha. Let's see if she approves it. I think so. Yeah, it's Pantera approved. It looks like this. I think I'll be using this more of a um, like body highlighter. This is a little bit too dark for me, at least right now. But I think during summer it's just going to look amazing. I don't have anything like this, so I'm really excited um, about this highlighter. I just, I feel like this is a very beautiful golden shade. I honestly might even use this on my eyes. Like right now, I'm using highlighter as an eyeshadow and I like it. I'm feeling the glowy but natural look at the moment, so this is perfect. I know I'm talking a lot with my hands. I don't know why I'm doing this. I think maybe it's because I haven't filmed in so long that I just don't know how to film. Um, so sorry if that's annoying. And anyway, I got this pencil lip gloss, uh, crayon gloss in the shade 11. So beautiful. Just like so beautiful. I just so cute. I love this. I love this. No. Yeah, this is just a lip crayon, a glossy one. I really like this shade. It's a warm, dark but not super dark, dark brown. Yeah, super cute. Next, I got this Gossamer Emotion Creamy Lipstick in the shade 
103. I think this is the most beautiful nude I've ever owned because this is just the perfect nude for me. This is how it looks on my skin. Um, I don't think the camera is doing it justice, but it looks... It's not super pink, it's not super orangey, it's just the perfect nude for me. Next, I got this long-lasting eyeshadow stick in the shade 7. So it looks like this. Again, I'm just really feeling the super glowy eyeshadows. It's a very light go. Oh, oh, que estás a fazer? Estás a fazer, sou maluca? Isso é a tua causa, Pantera? Olha a doitinha. Olha a doitinha. Hum, I think she likes it. This is just a very light gold shade. So beautiful. So cute. I love this. I literally love this. I don't know if you can hear her just grooming yourself because she's such a clean, fresh, you know. Okay, then I got the Sicilian Notes Long Lasting Eyeshadow Duo. Looks like this. It has a matte side and a shimmery metallic side so this is the matte shade i love this so much i mean this is just so cute so cute i love this i mean it's so beautiful i honestly can't wait to do my makeup tomorrow even though i'm not going anywhere i don't have anything to do tomorrow I'll be just doing my makeup because I really want to try all of these things out. And the last thing of this haul is the Green Me Lips and Cheeks. It's just that. Green Me Lips and Cheeks in the shade Poppy Red 103. So it comes with this pencil. And It also comes with this um, sharpener, like a big one, because, you know, this is a big pencil. It's very bright, but since it's more of a, um, like, not super pigmented shade, it's just so cute. It's just so cute, just effortless. A little bit here, a little bit here, and just glowy, done, ready to go. I love this. Okay, and this is everything for today's haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please make sure to subscribe, like it, and I'll see you very, very soon on my next one. Bye!